So we're gonna run errands after the gym. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take us some Gatorade. That way after the gym, we can put our creatine in our Gatorade. We're gonna do like a scoopy. And we're gonna do strawberry margarita and then I'm also gonna mix it with l quarantine. El we just got to the gym. Uh, we're gonna hit legs. The face oil that I use makes my face like so, so shiny like if I'm sweating but I like really love it because I just feel like it makes me glow. Okay, waiting for Danny. Hello. Okay, wait, I'm gonna do three sets. Tom, what are you doing? It's thirsty. And then I'm gonna switch it up after 12 reps. So these steps. Look at my feet. Don't look for a funny guy because then everything's a joke to them. Look at this guy. First things first, we always need some lip gloss. Hello guys. So I constantly get a lot of questions asking, what are my favorite supplements? What supplements do I take? How do I take them? Can I mix them? When do I take them? So I thought that I would do a video here on YouTube and just give you guys all the details about all of my favorite supplements, how to take them, when to take them, all that good stuff. So we're gonna jump right into it. I get all my supplements from a brand called EHP Labs and one of the products you guys see me talk a lot about is OxyShred. It's a thermogenic fat burner. It's gonna give you energy. It's gonna boost your metabolism. It's gonna cut your cravings for a little bit and it also can be used as a pre-workout. I say it can be used as a pre-workout just because it gives you energy, but it's not like pre-workout where you get jittery and itchy. If I'm doing an upper body stay or if I'm just doing like a Pilates and a cardio day where I need like a little pick me up, I will use Oxy Shred to fuel my workout. Oxy Shred is best to be taken on an empty stomach in the morning so that it can burn fat. Of course, you can still drink Oxy Shred if you eat, but I like to take it first thing in the morning on an empty stomach. And what's cool about Oxy Shred is that you can have two servings a day. What I do sometimes is I'll take this Oxy Shred first thing in the morning when I wake up. Like later on in the afternoon, if I'm getting a little tired and I need some energy. I'll drink the Oxy Shred in a can. They're pretty much the same thing, just this one is lightly carbonated and this one's ready to go. So I always have a few of these in the fridge ready for me to just like grab and go. And then this one, the powder one in the tub, I like to take this in the morning because I like to mix it with l carnitine. l carnitine basically just helps break down your fat into energy so that you're able to burn it off. Um, so I like to mix these two together and I find that when I mix these two together, I get real sweaty from my workout. And in my mind, I just feel like it's kind of better when you sweat more. But you can mix it with your Oxy Shred or you can mix it with your pre-workout. And Oxy Shred, you can still take it on days that you don't work out just because it, it gives you energy. Back in the day, I used to be a heavy coffee drinker. I would have like three cups of coffee a day. I switched out my coffee for my Oxy Shred because Oxy Shred gives me that energy that coffee would give me. I don't really drink coffee as much anymore. I mean, occasionally, like when I go to Target and I'm running around doing errands, I'll kind of stop and get a Starbucks just for like the aesthetic of it but I don't drink coffee like I used to. Some of my favorite flavors for Oxy Shred are Comic Blast Raspberry Refresh, Mongo is an OG, 
and I've really been liking their new limited edition Bahama Blast flavor. That flavor is very like orangey and pineapple-y to me. It just kind of reminds me of summer, I would say. I lean towards like tart or sourish flavors. So I like the Raspberry Refresh and Comic Blast because I feel like those are kind of like tartish and soury. If that makes sense. <laughs> Another question that I commonly get is if OxyShred has caffeine. OxyShred does have caffeine, but if you are someone who is sensitive to caffeine, there is a non-stim Oxy. So same benefits as OxyShred, except it doesn't have caffeine. So if you are someone who wants all the benefits that OxyShred offers, but you just can't handle caffeine, I would definitely do the non-stim OxyShred. All the flavors are amazing as well. Moving on to the next supplement. Now we got RP Max. So RP Max is a pre-workout. This one is going to give you the jitters. It is going to get you a really good pump. The reason why I like RP Max a lot though is because it doesn't give you like crazy jitters. I've had like pre-workouts where I'm just like, my fingertips are itchy, my ears are itchy. I'm like in the car like... Because I just like can't stand the itchiness and the tingliness that pre-workout like that certain pre-workouts give me um, Also, I've taken pre-workouts that they're so strong. They literally like make me throw up RP max is good I feel like um, you can take RP max if you are a beginner and not really used to pre-workout yet and the flavor that I love from RP max is strawberry daiquiri I usually take pre-workout on my lower body days and like I mentioned um, right now on my upper body days or on my days where I just do Pilates and cardio I'll do like oxy shred as like my pre-workout and then on my lower days I'll do RP max moving on we got oxy greens so oxy greens are basically your daily vegetable intake they're also going to help aid your digestive system they're going to help with bloating and it has a lot of prebiotic fibers in them so oxy greens do make you use the restroom i don't use the restroom every day and i notice that when i take oxy greens like, it does help me use the restroom my favorite flavor from the oxy greens is the strawberry margarita but i'm not lying to you guys all of them are so freaking good like when i got all three of the oxy greens i was like Hands down, the strawberry margarita is going to be my favorite one. But then I tried the pineapple one. Pineapple is one of my favorite flavors as well. And I love the pineapple as well. So then in my head, I was like, eh, the forest berries is going to be like my least favorite of all the oxy greens. I tried the forest berry oxy greens and I was like, I can't place first, second, third between the three flavors of the oxy greens because they're all so good. It really just depends on like if you prefer berries or something sour. Cool is that I like will switch between the three throughout the week just depending like what my mood is what i'm drinking with it what i'm eating with it you know and something i've been doing recently is mixing my oxy greens with aqua collagen aqua collagen is like a three-in-one supplement i think it's so freaking cool so aqua collagen has collagen it has protein and it has electrolytes from the coconut water that's in here so it's like a three-in-one supplement. My favorite would probably have to be like the watermelon one. If I'm drinking it by myself, the watermelon one is so good. It tastes just so refreshing, but all of them are so good. And, but I've been liking to mix the Oxy Greens and the Aqua Collagen. So you can just like kill two birds with one stone because sometimes taking too many supplements, like you forget to take some because you just have so many supplements to take or at least that's how I feel sometimes. So if you can mix like more than one supplement together, I think that's super cool. But I like to mix the flavors that go together. Oxy Greens comes in three flavors. It comes in pineapple, it comes in strawberry margarita, and it comes in forest berries. And then the Aqua Collagen also comes in three flavors. It comes in pineapple, raspberry, and watermelon wow. Raspberry, Aqua Collagen, and like the forest berries, Oxy Greens, I go together. And then the ones that I've been liking to do from these two are Aqua Collagen in pineapple flavor with the Oxy Greens in pineapple flavor since they're both pineapple like why not? <laughs> also, what I like about Oxy Greens is that 
we don't eat as much vegetables as we should be eating, so this definitely helps. And then the aqua collagen, like I briefly mentioned, it has collagen in it, which collagen is really good for your hair, skin, and nails. Also has proteins. Each scoop of the aqua collagen has 10 grams of protein in it. You can take up to two scoops a day with this, so that's 20 grams of protein. And what's cool about the aqua collagen is it's basically like flavored water or like flavored juice, you know? And you would think because it has protein in it that it's like a thick drink, but it's not. It tastes so freaking good. When I first tried this, I was just so shook because I'm like, how is it so good? Like collagen, protein, hydration, all in one, and it's literally like a juice. So you can drink this with your meal. You can drink this alone, which a lot of the times I was drinking it alone, but then I started noticing that I wasn't like, taking all my supplements consistently because I just take so many in one day. So I started to mix the aqua collagen and the aqua greens into one drink and it's really good. They're both really good. The oxy greens are really good. I've tried a couple other greens where they just have like a really grassy flavor and I just can't finish them. Oxy greens are really good though. Um, so you can literally have it with a meal because it's not gross. Um, and both the aqua collagen and the aqua greens, you can have them at whatever time of day you want. So now I'm gonna briefly talk about Oxy Shred energy drinks. So these are energy drinks, so you can compare them to like the Alani new energy drinks. Whenever I need like a little pick me up, this is what I grab. Um, if I'm cleaning the house or if I'm gonna go out and run some errands and I need some energy, I'll take my Oxy energy drink or like I said if I'm doing upper body or arms later on in the afternoon after I've already taken the oxy shred from the tub I'll drink one of these just to give me like a little energy for my workout no crash zero sugars and they come in a lot of really good flavors my favorite might be the Bahama breeze or the piña colada a lot of people ask me like what's your favorite flavors it really just depends on like what type of things you prefer like me like i said i prefer like soury or like tart stuff or if i'm if it's a fruit flavor i prefer like pineapple or mango and now coming up to the last supplement i have my creatine this creatine is flavorless so you can mix it it says to take it after your workout i know some people take their creatine during the workout and I also know some people that take their creatine before their workout so it really just depends the instructions on this one say to take it after your workout so I take it after my workout and since it is flavorless I do mix it with stuff if I prepare for the gym I'll try to take like a Gatorade with me so that I can mix my creatine with my Gatorade zero but I also like to mix the aqua collagen and the creatine together I like to mix it with the aqua collagen because since the aqua Aqua collagen does have hydration. I like to drink that after the gym. When we're at the gym and we're working out and we're sweating, you know, our body's getting dehydrated. Something else you can also do with the creatine is like make a smoothie and put a scoop of the creatine in your smoothie since it's flavorless. This is gonna wrap up my video for today. That is the tea with all my supplements. Um, I hope I didn't talk too fast. I hope I answered a lot of your guys' questions. I tried to like remember common questions that I get from you guys about my supplements. But let me know if you guys still have any questions about any of the supplements. Let me know down in the comments what your questions are and I will get back to you. Other than that, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.